before we get to the end, we have the center line of reinstatement. We need to come and reinstate the soil all around the building. Remember, we had excavated for the the vegetable soil and we reduced the level. Now we need to return the soil so that it can be like a normal ground up to this uh, ground level. We need to return the soil up to the ground level. You see this? Aha, uh -huh, here. It was in the spread. So we need to come and return. You know, we had returned the soil up to here, the reduced level. Now we need to come and return this soil that I will highlight in yellow or around the building. So how do we calculate for that volume of soil? We shall take the center line of reinstatement, which is, uh, we shall take the center of this spread here. You see here, it's the center of this spread. We go all around. So we shall take the external dimensions of this diagram. We take the external dimensions. External is up to there. We add the spread, both sides. Now, when we are adding the spread, we shall add a half. And we already learned how to take off uh, the center line using uh, the video that is on your screen. Um, it shows how to calculate the center line. We said we take the external dimensions of the spread. So we shall take the external dimensions of the uh, plan. We add the spread. We get the external dimensions of the spread. Then we deduct how number of corners times, times the thickness of the uh, spread. Remember the thickness of the spread is 200. Yeah. So uh, these corners, where we get them from is you take the number of external corners minus the number of internal corners. Which ones? External corners. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We deduct number of internal corners, which is 1. And we remain with 4. 4 corners, we multiply by the thickness of the foundation spread, we get 800. So 34,000 minus 800, we get 33,200. So center line, we multiply by the thickness of the spread, then the depth up to the reduced level. We deduct this load of soil from cut away and add it to refill and ram. We had said that all vegetable soil should be taken out to the soil heap called cut away. Now we need that soil to come and return that soil so that it can go back to the ground level. We shall deduct that load of soil from the cutaway and add to refill and ram. So that brings us to the end of the video. In case you like this video, kindly remember to give it a thumbs up. Kindly, kindly give it a thumbs up. Then in case you haven't subscribed to our channel, please subscribe to our channel. All right, so uh, feel free to share this video. Kindly share it to your cosmates, bring them on board. And we are happy to make these videos for you. So anyone who had, whoever had asked this question, who had told us to do a simple takeoff for you. This one is a simple one. I hope it helps you. After this one, go graduating, eh? learning how to take off. And sure enough, you'll be able to take off in the easiest way possible. So see you in the next video.